Hey guys, and thank you so much for watching my videos. Now I am super excited because I have an awesome Walgreens 70% off clearance haul for you guys and a Target 70% off clearance haul for you guys. Now I did take you along with me yesterday when I went clearance hunting, showed you guys how I found my deals, where to look and all that good stuff. I will link that video at the end of this video. So if you did not get a chance to, to check it out, definitely click on that and check it out. A lot of stuff I did not pick up is in that video and maybe you guys can go out and find those deals too. I did give some tips and suggestions so you may wanna check that video out. Like I said, I'll link that at the end of the video and in the description box. Now, if you're new to my channel, welcome. Don't forget to hit that like, subscribe, and notification bell so you're notified every time I upload new videos. I do have an awesome extreme coupon kit giveaway going on right now. I'm an extreme couponer, so I'm giving away a coupon binder, a planner, and a bunch of coupon accessories and bonus prizes. So if you have not entered to that, I will link that at the end of the video and in the description box so you guys can enter to win. So let's go ahead and jump right in. Let's go ahead and start with Walgreens. Walgreens, I only picked up a few things. If you saw my walkthrough, my store didn't have a whole lot of Valentine's. They had a ton of candy and a ton of like teddy bears and stuff. But since I don't really need the candy or the teddy bears, I decided to just see if there was any items I could possibly use for um, Easter, which I could have used the teddy bears, but I was just like, no, nah, I really don't want to put that in their Easter baskets. Kind of deciding. I did pick up one thing at Target for Easter baskets. The things I was super excited about finding at Walgreens were the heaters. If you saw my walkthrough, then you know they had some amazing heaters. I only bought one. My aunt had actually been looking for a heater. She's like me. She gets cold a lot. I actually have a heater going in here. Um, and she's like, I really want a heater and they're hard to find and they're, you know, kind of expensive at Walmart, even at Target. But these were on clearance for six bucks. She only needed a spare. They had a really nice one that had like a imitation flame in front of it, like super fancy. That one was 15 but these were six bucks guys if you see it i highly recommend you pick it up these are the comfort zone america's heating and cooling choice tip over cut off switch overheat protection sensor and a stay cool housing it's adjustable thermostat and fan forced wide heat dispersion so really great deal for six dollars this was 73 percent off great deal on this I did pick up these because these are my husband's favorite. He's gonna be so excited when he sees these. I didn't even tell him that I got these for him. These are the 22 foil wrapped cherries by Sellas. He loved these. So this is cherry covered with real milk chocolate. So he loves these and these were 70% off. They were regularly $5.99 and these were ringing up for $8.79. So I picked these up for him. I could have possibly waited till 90%, but I'm not sure those go really fast. So I was surprised they were there. The next thing I picked up was this sloth. Um, let's see the sloth cutie with wings. He was regularly $6 and 99 cents. Isn't he cute? He's like a little sloth with a unicorn. And then he has a little wings in the back. Now, if you wanted to use this for Easter, you most certainly could. It does not ring Valentine's for me. You could put this in your Easter basket for one of your little ones. And this would be so cute to add with like the eggs and all that. Does not ring Valentine's to me. It is super duper cute, but I actually picked this up for a friend. She's obsessed with sloths. So this was um, regular priced at $6.99, but I did pick it up for $2.09. So not a bad deal for this. I will be shipping this off to you. You know who you are. Isn't this adorable? I thought it was so cute and nice and chunky. So I picked this up. Um, I did pick up two of the glass what are these things called the season of love glass water bottles i thought these would be great to add to mother's day gifts or maybe a tween um easter basket not sure yet they had them in pink and they had them in blue i picked up one of each now these were ringing up for how much were these selling for these regularly sell for six dollars and 99 cents so i was able to pick these up for trying to find it two dollars and nine cents guys not a bad deal for this so yeah i was super excited to find these picked up two of these the next thing that i picked up were these journals and if you guys saw my walkthrough i was excited to find them so i did pick up three um i picked up two in the cream i absolutely love these because they are a they're called the Season of Love Clutch Journal with 120 pages. Now they retailed for 
and 99 cents but i got them at 70 percent off for three dollars and 89 cents which i thought was a great deal they are a faux leather really really pretty i'm loving the gold detailing here it has a heart and a key i'm gonna use the blue one because it probably come up better on camera but it has the heart and the key really really cute it does zipper open so you can put like your stuff in here little clutch you can put like you know um, maybe your coupons or whatever that may be zip that up and then have your coupon list here so I did pick up one for a future coupon kit or maybe a possible giveaway this is so cute um, maybe your guys's next month's giveaway so I did pick up one for that I picked up one for a raffle gift and then I picked up one for maybe a family gift if I do one um, birthday gift or something like that so I picked up three I love that they are this faux leather, really, really pretty. If you guys see them, I think it's a definite pickup. Now, normally, um, I think their stuff hits 90% on the 20th, I wanna say, at Walgreens, um, but these would have been gone by the time I, it hit 90. I know that there wasn't a lot to pick and choose from, so I have a feeling that a lot of the items that I did pick up would have been gone if I would have waited to the 90. So that's kind of what I do, I pick and choose and see what they have low quantities of and then I pick it up. So the next thing I picked up and they only had one of these and I absolutely love this and I thought this would be perfect for Mother's Day. I love the colors on this. And this is the Love Faux Leather Pouch. Look at that, really pretty spring colors, pink. It has the gold detailing, it has two zippers. So I really liked this and this was uh, $1.79 really great deal so i picked this up it's a faux leather nice pick that up and then the last thing i picked up at walgreens were these gift bags and i love gift bags you guys know i do a speaking engagement every single month i run a nonprofit, so i do a speaking engagement to in you know empower and uplift women that are you know struggling financially or just trying to rebuild their lives i do that every single month and every month i give them a goodie bag so these were how much were these these were a $5.99, I can't believe these. So these were $1.79, guys, for these. And they're by Hallmark, so I went ahead and picked them up. I didn't think it was too bad of a deal for $1.79, 70% off, they're super pretty. And I definitely will be able to use them for my speaking engagements. You do get five of them, so not a bad deal because I do get, I think it's three for a dollar at Dollar Tree. So, and these are a little bit bigger, so I can put a lot more stuff in them. Super excited, so I did pick up two of these, and that's a quantity of 10. So that is everything that I got at Walgreens. Let's go ahead and take a look at all of the awesome items I found at Target. So at Target, the first place I hit was the um, Valentine's Day section. Now, if you guys saw my walkthrough, you know it was kind of slim pickings at my Valentine's Day section. It usually isn't like that, but I had a feeling like Valentine's Day is a little bit of a bigger holiday out in the area that I go to. Um, but Easter, not so much. There's not a lot of kids in that area. So I know Easter, I'm really gonna be able to score, but Valentine's Day with Slim Pickens, I think there's a lot of more younger couples in that area than there is um, older couples with kids. Not saying that younger couples don't have kids, but these are like, I call them hipsters. I don't know if that word is still, still used, but you know, they're like in their, they're not really like 25, 26, or like 23, 24, I wanna say, and you know, they're still young and going out and doing all the fun stuff that we used to do when we were that age. Okay, let me go, I'm, I'm rambling. Okay, so these were ringing up 70% off, I showed you in that video. Um, definitely scan, guys, I highly recommend you scan. These retailed for $3, they were 90 cents, so I picked up two for next year for my granddaughters. I thought, I call them my grand girls. Um, I know I always send them something every single holiday, so I always start collecting. So next year I have already a pack set for them and I didn't spend a lot of money. So, so far I've spent a dollar and 80 cents on them. So not a bad deal, but the retail value is $3. So I did pick these up. I also picked up some stuff for their um, Easter baskets. So I picked up three of these and I thought these were really cool. I knew that they would not, um be in store very long they didn't have very many of these so i got these at 70 percent off these were a dollar and 70 cent i don't know a dollar and 50 cents um batteries are not included so you need two double a batteries i picked up three these are the glow art create unlimited designs light up your imagination and it comes with a case to store all the little things remember the 
glow brights. These were like so popular when, you know, I was a kid. But yeah, these are so cute. And I picked up three. I picked up one for Miss Naya and two for the grand girls to put in their Easter baskets. Something fun to have. And I think they're really going to enjoy that. So that is the first thing I found for them for their Easter baskets. I basically went to look for items for their Easter basket this year and look for items for their Valentine's Day gift next year. So I don't have to really worry about it. The next thing I found were some Valentine's Day bags. I know I will definitely use them. You get a 12 count or I will send these to um, Sarah, uh, my daughter-in-law, so she can use them for the girls. So I bought two packages, which is 24 bags. You can do like little cupcakes or whatever. These retailed for $2, but they were 70% off really really cute uh, you can also still use them throughout the year i'm a hearts girl i love hearts so this is something i probably would have still used throughout the year but i'm going to send these to sarah and her um valentine's day pack for next year so she has something for the girls another thing i found for sarah was the cupcake wrappers and toppers because i know a lot of times she makes stuff for the girls to send to school um her school is not as strict as like this they're in vegas they're and she goes to they go to like a private school so it's not as strict as like the public schools where you have to buy everything in the packaging and you can't unwrap things and everything has to be wrapped um they do allow you to make actual cupcakes remember when you used to be able to like say mom make cupcakes for the class make cupcakes for the class now you can't do that well out here you can't do that you have to buy it from the store because i know i had the same issue with naya Anyways, sorry about that. Um, these are the cupcake wrappers and toppers. I thought this would be really cute. She did, doesn't really have to use it for Valentine's Day. She may be able to use it for summer, for a summer party, but I know I'm gonna send it off next year, but these are really cute. And these were $5, but they were 70% off. And you know, these are so cute. Look at that. You can do so much with that. So pick those up. That'd be perfect if you guys are having a birthday party or your kids' birthdays in the summer. You just grab some of those and you make some cupcakes. That'd be so cute. The next thing I picked up, and these were ringing up for $1.50, and these are for Easter baskets. These are the Amazing Putty, and they're laser putty, and you can collect them all. Um, includes a UV light pen. So I thought these were kind of cool, so I picked up one in the Amazing Putty, and then I picked up one in this one, which is the Blue Electric. And then I picked up, of course, one in the unicorn for Lana. So this one is probably going to be for Naya, Lois, and Lana. So I'm making three Easter baskets for these girls. So got those for their Easter baskets. I also went ahead and picked up two of the squishies. I should have got three because I was not thinking. Um, but these are the Series 2. These are ringing up for $1.50. These are so cute. I don't know. They're kind of like a surprise. They didn't have a, a lot of these or I would have probably passed till they hit 90, but unfortunately they only had a few. So I picked up two of these and these were $1.50. These are the options they came in. So I picked up this one for Lois and this one for Lana. Lana's a little bit more girly and Lois is like a little bit of a tomboy. Um, she's kind of growing out of it. So it's kind of exciting because it gives me an opportunity to buy more things for her because I always get stuck with the boys. I don't know what it is. I did pick up two of the slime kits. Now I picked up one for Lois and then one for Naya. Uh, Lana's not really into slime like that. So these were $1.50 and this was $1.50. So this is the Mix and Slime Glowing Amazing Slime and $1.50. I picked this up for Naya's Easter Basket and then one for Lois's Easter Basket. I thought they would really like these. So I got these at $1.50. Like I said, the quantities weren't a lot or else I probably would have waited till it hit 90%. But that is okay. You know, I'm still saving money. I'm not going out to Target and buying them at full retail price because right now I would have already spent like $25 on each kid just on little accessories like that so love when I can get them super cheap now I did buy one of these I fell in love with these at Target now this was me going down the aisles and looking for items these were ringing up at 70% off now they retailed for $12.99 they're ringing up for $3.88 these are the cat and jack little handbags aren't these adorable so I picked up one in the unicorn. Now I really, really hope Lois will wear this. I'm not 100% sure, but you know, cause like I said, she's kind of tomboyish, but I think this is so pretty. Look at that, the, the detailing on that for $3.88, perfect for their Easter basket guys. So excited to find that one. And then they had this adorable little um, fox. Isn't this cute? 
and look at the fur detailing and the glitter on this. Now this one was $3.88 as well, retailed for $12.99. Really cute handbag with the strap. So I'll be putting this in their Easter baskets and I think they're absolutely going to, to love this. So I picked this up for them. And then I picked up two of the cute heart notebooks. These were $1.20, they were 70% off. Thought that was a great deal for 70% off for next year for their little Valentine's Day um, gift. So they say cute on them and I thought they would really enjoy them. Now, the next thing that I picked up, if I can reach it, I picked up this for Naya's Easter basket. This is the Scoops Squishy Pillow. This I showed on my, um, in, in the Target walkthrough I did showing you guys the clearance. This retailed for $14.99 but it was ringing up for $4.49 and I'm obsessed with it. I actually really like it. Now they had it in the donut and I totally would have gotten the donut. However, the donut was stained. So I didn't pick it up because I didn't want to give it to the girls. So I decided, well, since I only have one and I don't want the girls arguing, I'm going to put it in Naya's Easter basket. So I got to find a huge basket for her and put this in here. I think she's really going to like it. She loves these kind of pillows. I think she has a ton of them. Her mom's going to kill me, but that is okay. So I picked this one up for $4.49. Great deal on that. Now I have some more stuff behind me. Let me grab that and we'll continue. I had a ton of toy clearance. I did go over that in my walkthrough. I will link that video, like I said, at the end of this video so you guys can take a look. Ton of stuff. Some of it was 50 and some of it was 70. You just have to basically look. Now these are amazing. These are the Umbro. And this one is from ages nine to 12. It's a size four soccer brawl. Now it retailed for $14.99. They were 70% off, so I got it at $4.48. So I picked up a couple of these. I didn't wanna show you how many. I picked up two of these. And then for the other kids, I picked up whatever they had because this is the age I always struggle with for my toy drive. So this is the Umbro from ages 13 and older. They had several different sizes if you're looking for these. These are 70% off and they were ringing up at $4.48. This is a great deal even to hold on to for like birthday gifts, Christmas. I'm gonna use them for my toy drive because these are great for the older boys to give them you know, as a gift. Sometimes I have the hardest time finding them gifts. So I picked those two up and then I was happy because I found myself some jeans. Now these are 50% off. They retailed for $32.99. I got them for $16.48. These are the Levi's jeans. These are high-waisted and I'm super excited. Probably going to wear these today um, with some boots. I think these are so cute and they're super comfortable. I did try them on in store. So I was super excited to find these check your clothing they had a ton of clothes 50 to 70 percent off i did find something for amanda for our israel trip we are going to be going to israel on a missions trip the the weather there we've been checking is about 60 to 70 degrees so it's not too hot but it's also kind of chilly to me it's kind of chilly so she's a hot box i call her hot box because she's always like hot she's like it's so hot in here i'm like it's freezing but in case she does get cold, I wanted to get her like a lightweight jacket. She can easily tie around her waist. Um, I thought this was a great deal. This was 70% off, guys. I got it in a small. It was regularly $34.99. This is the Champion, Champion Fleece. Sorry, my cord's mixed up here. The Champion Fleece Jacket, regularly $34.99. I got it for $10.48. I used my Target Red card to get an additional 5% off my total. So I was super excited about all of my finds. This is everything that I picked up at Walgreens and Target. I hope you guys are having a fabulous, blessed day. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to watch my videos. And if you like these videos, please remember to like and subscribe so you never miss an episode. Don't forget to check out those um, um, come with me to Walgreens and Target clearance hunting. Might give you guys some ideas of what could be available at your stores. Don't forget to enter for that extreme coupon kit. I'll link those videos at the end of this videos. And you guys have a fabulous, blessed day. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.